him to put his heel on the knee of the other leg mm -hmm. and go through the leg on the leg. And if he, there is some discoordination, you will see that he can't put it right on the knee, on the knee. Mm -hmm. He will drop it somewhere, oh. not on the knee. Mm -hmm. Sometimes he doesn't know where to his eyes are closed. Sometimes he doesn't know which way to go with his heel. And sometimes when he goes on his leg, his other leg goes like this. This is intentional. Oh. Okay? So when he goes the finger nose test, when he does also the same way. His finger goes like this, sometimes it drops here, there, and somewhere else. So this is the test. The other one test we can also ask the patient to do. We, we just put in front of him uh, our... For example, the doctor puts his finger in front of the patient and we ask the patient to hit the target, to put his hand just on my hand, on my finger, okay? One <coughs> finger and the other hand also to put it. The other way is we ask the patient to put his fingers together. Mm. And if there is this coordination, he can't do this. The other test is, we ask the patient to lift his ha one hand up. The other one is in front of him. Mm. And we ask him quickly to put his lifted arm down. Mm -hmm. So if there is, again, this coordination, he will put it more down. It is hypermetropia, metria. Mm. Hypermetria. Hypermetria. Hy oh. Hyper. But teacher, do the patient realize that they the problem? Yeah. Yeah, he can. It means he knows that. Yeah, he knows I that, but he can't do it because his connections between the cerebellum oh. and the spinal cord oh, are, are affected. Oh, means he realizes. Yes, he realizes. Yeah. 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 Speech. Mm -hmm. So he can't speak quickly, and this we named Bradi Lalia. He he talks slowly. Bradi Lalia. He can't speak quickly. Mm -hmm. Bradi Lalia. Slowly. Then sometimes there is the problem with spelling the words. And uh, when you talk with the patient, you feel that he's some. It, it, it feels like he eats something, and that's why he can't produce and spell the words quite well. Mm -hmm. Means, like Means uh, mouthful. Uh, yeah, mouthful. Oh. Okay. And we call it disartria. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, then. Uh, the problem, uh, the other one problem could be with writing. And if you ask the patient to write his name or some sentences, you will find that he can't write well, because again, discoordination in his hand. So mostly they write with big, um, big words and, and big uh, alphabets and so on. This is megalographia. Megala, big. The other one test is it equals pronation test. We ask the patient to put his hand in front of him and then to quickly to move his hands. Okay, so he, he, he gets them like this mm -hmm. and then you ask them, him to quickly to pronate his hands like this. That hand that is disturbed, he will do it more. Uh, okay? It's more will be pronated. Mm -hmm. We call it dysmetria. Dysmetria. It's the same as hypermetria. It's the same as hypermetria. Mm -hmm. The same. 